Welcome to the second part on cultivating peace of mind. We'll be discussing and exploring emotional intelligence and its role in reaching inner peace, gratitude and positive thinking and its power in achieving peace of mind, goal setting and time management and its importance in accomplishing peace of mind, sustaining peace of mind for long term. Well, let's start with emotional intelligence, but before that, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. If you like our videos, please share it with your friends and family. Emotional intelligence is the ability to recognize, understand, and manage our own emotions, while also being able to perceive and respond to the emotions of others. It involves a range of skills, including self-awareness, self-regulation, empathy, and social skills. So why is emotional intelligence important for achieving peace of mind? Well, our emotions can have a significant impact on our mental and physical well-being. When we are unable to regulate our emotions, we may experience stress, anxiety, and other negative emotions that can affect our overall quality of life. On the other hand, when we have high emotional intelligence, we are better equipped to handle difficult situations, form healthy relationships, and make positive choices. We are also more likely to experience positive emotions, such as joy, contentment, and gratitude. Let's take a closer look at some of the key skills involved in emotional intelligence. 1. Self-awareness. This involves recognizing and understanding our own emotions, as well as our strengths and limitations. By developing self-awareness, we can become more in tune with our thoughts and feelings, and better able to regulate our emotions. 2. Self-regulation. This skill involves being able to control our impulses and manage our emotions in healthy ways. This may involve strategies such as deep breathing, mindfulness, or reframing negative thoughts. 3. Empathy. Empathy involves understanding and feeling the emotions of others. By developing empathy, we can improve our relationships with others and communicate more effectively. 4. Social skills. This involves the ability to navigate social situations, communicate effectively, and form healthy relationships. By developing strong social skills, we can build a support system that can help us manage stress and other negative emotions. To develop emotional intelligence, it is important to practice these skills regularly. This may involve techniques such as journaling, meditation, or seeking the help of a therapist or counselor. In addition, it is important to be kind and compassionate to ourselves as we work to develop these skills. Remember that emotional intelligence is a journey, and it takes time and practices to build these skills. Summing up, emotional intelligence is a crucial component of achieving peace of mind. By developing self-awareness, self-regulation, empathy, and social skills, we can become more resilient, manage stress more effectively, and form healthier relationships. Now after emotional intelligence, we will explore the power of gratitude and positive thinking in achieving inner peace. Gratitude is the practice of acknowledging and appreciating the good things in our lives. It involves focusing on the positive aspects of our experiences, even in the midst of challenging circumstances. Positive thinking, on the other hand, involves actively choosing to focus on positive thoughts and beliefs, rather than dwelling on negative ones. Both gratitude and positive thinking can have a powerful impact on our mental and emotional well-being. Research has shown that practicing gratitude and positive thinking can improve mood, reduce stress and anxiety, and enhance overall life satisfaction. So how can we cultivate gratitude and positive thinking in our daily lives? Here are a few strategies to consider. Keep a gratitude journal. Taking time each day to write down the things you are grateful for can help shift your focus to the positive aspects of your life. This can be as simple as writing down three things you are grateful for each day. Practice mindfulness. Mindfulness involves being present in the moment, without judgment or distraction. By practicing mindfulness, we can become more aware of the positive aspects of our experiences and better able to appreciate them. Reframe negative thoughts. When negative thoughts arise, try to reframe them in a more positive light. For example, instead of dwelling on what went wrong in a situation, 
Focus on what you learned or how you can improve next time. Express gratitude to others. Taking time to express gratitude to others can not only make them feel appreciated, but it can also help cultivate gratitude in your own life. Consider writing a thank you note, sending a text, or simply telling someone in person how much you appreciate them. By incorporating these practices into our daily lives, we can develop a more positive mindset and cultivate a greater sense of peace and contentment. In conclusion, gratitude and positive thinking are powerful tools for achieving inner peace. By focusing on the positive aspects of our lives and choosing to see the good in even challenging situations, we can improve our mental and emotional well-being and enhance our overall quality of life. Our next ingredient for peace of mind is the importance of goal setting and time management in achieving inner peace. Setting goals and managing our time effectively can help us create a sense of purpose and direction in our lives. It can also help us prioritize our tasks and reduce feelings of overwhelm and stress. So how can we set effective goals and manage our time in a way that supports our overall well-being? Here are a few strategies to consider. Define your goals. Take time to reflect on what you want to achieve in different areas of your life, such as career, relationships, health, and personal growth. Write down specific and measurable goals that align with your values and priorities. Break down your goals. Once you have defined your goals, break them down into smaller, manageable steps. This will make them feel more achievable and help you stay motivated. Create a schedule. Use a planner or digital calendar to schedule your tasks and activities. This will help you stay organized and ensure you have enough time to focus on your goals. Prioritize self-care. Make sure to prioritize self-care activities, such as exercise, meditation, or spending time with loved ones, in your schedule. This will help you maintain balance and reduce stress. Review and adjust. Regularly review your progress towards your goals and adjust your approach as needed. Celebrate your successes along the way and learn from any setbacks. By incorporating these strategies into your daily life, you can set yourself up for success in achieving your goals while also maintaining a sense of peace and well-being. In conclusion, goal setting and time management are important tools for achieving inner peace. By defining your goals, breaking them down into manageable steps, creating a schedule, prioritizing self-care, and regularly reviewing your progress, you can create a sense of purpose and direction in your life while also reducing stress and overwhelm. By now we must have understood the importance of peace of mind. How to attain and indulge it our life. Now we will be discussing the last and utmost important part, how to sustain a sense of peace of mind and well-being over the long term. Achieving peace mind and well-being is not a one-time event, but rather an ongoing process that requires consistent effort and attention. In order to sustain our peace of mind, we must be intentional about prioritizing our mental and emotional health. So how can we sustain peace of mind in our daily lives? Here are a few strategies to consider. Practice self-awareness. Take time to reflect on your thoughts and feelings and identify any patterns or triggers that may be impacting your mental and emotional well-being. Prioritize self-care. Make self-care activities, such as exercise, healthy eating, and relaxation, a regular part of your routine. Consistently taking care of your physical and emotional needs can help you feel more centered and grounded. Cultivate positive relationships. Surround yourself with people who uplift and support you. Cultivating positive relationships can help you feel more connected and supported. Set boundaries. Learn to say no to things that drain your energy or do not align with your values. Setting healthy boundaries can help you conserve your mental and emotional resources. Practice gratitude. Take time to appreciate the good things in your life, even during difficult times. Cultivating a sense of gratitude can help you stay positive and optimistic. By incorporating these strategies into your daily life, you can sustain a sense of peace of mind and well-being over the long term. 
In conclusion, sustaining peace of mind requires consistent effort and attention. By practicing self-awareness, prioritizing self-care, cultivating positive relationships, setting boundaries, and practicing gratitude, you can create a sustainable sense of peace of mind and well-being. Thank you for joining me for this module, and I hope you found it informative and helpful.